Good evening, boys and girls. Welcome to Candy's Cozy Couch. My name is Candace, and my nickname is Candy. That's how I came up with that really determined name. At least I think it's pretty determined. Also, the characters in the book, I think she's pretty determined to do what she can do. All right, boys and girls, here we go. We are going to let's get it started with my ukulele guitar that I can't play with a lick. It's time for the checklist. It's time for the checklist. It's time for the checklist. The check is just like this. All right, well, you know, I do my best, which is usually my worst, so that just means I gotta do better. All right, boys and girls, checklist time. Let's see. Have you had a great dinner? Are your bellies all full and satisfied? Check. Have you had a family chat where you can discuss things and talk about things and ask questions and give suggestions and tell ideas and open up and just love on your family? Check. Did you do your homework? Boys and girls, you know you got to do your homework. Exercise that brain and maintain that brilliance. Check. Uh, have you done your chores? Teamwork makes the dream work. So you're part of team family. So have you helped out around the house? Cleaned up a little bit? Check. All right. Let's see what's next. Have you guys picked out your outfit that you're going to wear for tomorrow? So you don't have to do it tonight. Check. And did you get your PJs gathered? Got to gather up your PJs. Check. Turn those night lights on, boys and girls, so you can see in the dark if you need to. Check. Let's see. You take those baths or showers so you're all fresh and clean and your body's refreshed. Check. And then after you dry it off, did you lotion your body? Got to oil your skin. You know, you got to keep it moist so it's not so dry. Check. Have you cleaned your ears? Have you cleaned your nose if you need to? Check. Have you brushed your teeth and are your teeth all shiny and gleaming and glistening and white? Check. And have you flossed between the gaps of the teeth? Check. And if you have some rinse or wash, mouthwash to gargle and rinse out your mouth, make it even more fresh and refreshing and breath awesome, right? Check. Have you combed your hair, parted your hair, braided your hair, did something with your hair? I'm tired of doing that now at this point. I got to move on from that. Do something with your hair. Huh? Check. Oh, let's see. What else? Have you cleaned your room? It's a separate chore that I always make a note to make emphasis on. If you cleaned your room, then you're ready to go. You're good to go. Everything's where it needs to be. Check. Let's see, what else? Because I'm coming along pretty good. Have you given your I love yous, hugs, kisses, smooches, and just everything that you need to give love-wise to your family and your pets and any friends that are visiting? Show them love, too. Check. Hmm. I pretty much covered almost everything. One last time in the bathroom, boys and girls. Make sure you pee or poo. Get that last one in so you go to bed. I don't have any issues. Check. And let's see. Before you drift off into dreamland, have you had a story yet? You gotta go with the story. And if not, here we are at Candy's Cozy Couch. Let's get this story in, right? Check. First, make sure you say your prayers. If you have not said your prayers, make sure you say them before you drift off into dreamland. You know how we do it. Check. Now. With your cuddle buddies, all gathered, snug as a bug in a rug. Let's get this story on the road. Tonight's story is called Betsy Lewis's You Can Do It. Now, Betsy Lewis is the author of the book. 
And literally it says, you can do it. On the back, I'm looking at the back, it says, no, you can't. And another one says, yes, I can. If you like to read, you will like this book. And it says that Betsy Lewis likes to read, draw, and make great books for children. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're checking it out. This is kind of cool. All the poses. Are these alligators or crocodiles? I'm not sure. You Can Do It by Betsy Lewis. Okay. Big Race Sunday. Oh. 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 It's Big Race Sunday. Okay. I can win. No, you can't. Yes, I can. Look at this argument going on here. The no, you can't. Yes, I can. Argument. Cannot. Can so. Cannot. No, no, wait a minute. Nah. She didn't have to push him down. Nah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Didn't have to do all of that. Yes, you, we, you can. Can so, can so, can so. What? Okay. Puff, 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 puff. Too slow, too slow. Can't. Oh. Can so how to win? Cannot. Okay, so wait a minute now. Y'all both need to encourage. I like that she gave a book. That's good. Can so can so reading the how to win book. One, two, I can do it. One, two, I can do it. One, two, I can do it. Now, mind you, getting those yoga stretches in, getting it in there. Yes, you got to stretch to get the body ready. All right, that certainly will help you do it. One, two, I can 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 do it. Okay. Talk about determination, right? Very determined not to give up. I like the positive attitude. I can do it. I can do it. And that's a very important phrase. I don't see any apostrophe T's. Okay? So you believe you can, then you will. You can do it. And now they're at the start line for the race. S T A R T, start. Okay. See what happens. Can I do it? I can do it. I love the encouragement. So much better than saying, no, oh, you can't. All right. Wonder what's going to happen. Wonder what's going to happen. I did it. Yay. See what happens when you believe that you can do something? And you stay determined, that's how you get things done. So boys and girls always have an I can attitude. 
Remember, if you say you can, then you will. And there are no apostrophe T's in can. Okay? So, when you think you about to add that apostrophe T, okay? Because you can do whatever you put your mind to. Just like with your dreams, it's kind of hand in hand. You can use those dreams too to help you with your eye cans. And boys and girls, of course, we're down to that time where you get ready to go into dreamland. So get snug as a bug in the rug in your bed where you're safe and sound and loved and comfortable in your own room. And let's take it there. You can close your eyes whisper to yourself what you would like to dream about any I can statement whatever it is you want to learn how to do whatever it is you know how to do whatever it is you want to have a C-A-N no apostrophe T sounds like a good dream to me tell yourself what you would like to dream about let your body relax be calm cool and collected and drift on off to sleep so that you can dream your special dream. Yes, you can. I believe in you, and I believe in me too. So I'm going to go ahead and dream my special dream. All right. Have a good night, boys and girls. Bye-bye.